Morphix and his Glock rig are going down faster than Enron. Let's rock. Hey everybody, welcome back to more Duke Nukem Manhattan Project.com. I'm still Negroth, I still have Deceitful Penguin here with me. I'm actually a fishing site, Deceitful Penguin. He is a fishing boat? No, Maybe. fishing site. Fishing site. Yeah. A site for fishing. And how about that dated reference, huh? We all know what happened with Enron. They were a massively evil corporation. They were just a corporation like any other. They, they were a timeless meme set into stone, ready to be handed down through the ages. And you know, if this ship is going to be like Enron, does that mean only the captain and the first mate are going to get out and all the passengers and crew drown? Yes. It, this, well, this, uh, this oil rig, which is what we're on for some reason, is, uh, it's much like a Ponzi scheme, uh, if a Ponzi scheme was like an oil rig. Ah, uh, yes. So, yeah. you, you, you can make comparisons between anything. This cow is a lot like a Volkswagen if a Volkswagen was like a cow. Uh, uh, are, you talking, they, are you talking are you talking metaphor? Well the cow yeah. is for the people, right? And you could you could ride on the cow. So it is, you know, it is like the people's pocket. Uh I don't know. The Volkswagen was as originated from Hitler was just the idea that every German should have an automobile. Uh, Affordable, cheap automobile. <laughs> but then we would have so much methane pollution, Paul. Think and of it, the planet. And a, a Jew in every pot. No. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, this is, a, this is a new environment. It's much different from what we've actually seen before. So, I mean, that's good. It's not a boat, and it's not a city, but it's still incredibly drab. And I'm really wondering what kind of fucking... Are, are we at an oil tanker or an oil rig? It's, it's like a drilling station. Okay, so it's an so oil it's rig. rig. Yeah, it's an oil rig. When did this become apparent except... Jesus Christ, look at that. You mentioned that before, the ocean. Yeah, the static image of the ocean. Well, it's a, but but, it's but, you'd, but you, if I hadn't drawn attention to it, you would have distracted them with those fine flexing moves. Yes, that's. We don't actually see that animation very often of the Duke. Uh, that's the Duke's it, Dukes. The the Duke hanging crab, I guess, would be a word for it. I'm trying to think of some sexy position. <laughs> the could. Duke, the Duke doing Dukey. No. Um, <laughs> it's your fault for showing me wrestling, Paul. That actually was just a movie, uh, No Holds Barred, which was actually not about um, lawyers at all, but was instead Hulk Hogan uh, facing uh, Zeus Tiny Lister in a match of fisticuffs, I suppose. Alright. No. Did, did you just did you, did you did you ever see the movie Friday? Um, uh, uh, of the series Friday after next, at, and then Friday next week, and then Friday before Christmas. But you never saw the first. I saw all of them. Okay. I saw. I went to the the movies and everything. I love Ice Cube. Now you remember like the 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 guy that was like a big drug dealer and everybody was like afraid of him. Yes. Uh, and he had he was like a big muscular dude. Yeah. Zebo. Yeah, 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 yeah. They they yeah. It's, they show that movie every Christmas. Yeah, that that guy is real. That guy's name is like uh, Zeus Lister or something like that. And in this uh, Hulk Hogan movie, No Hulk Bard, he uh, had to face this. They had to face off. Oh, well, that's nice. It uh, it was very moving. A bit like seeing you use another gun than the rocket launcher. Yeah, I uh, I decided I had enough bullets, so why not? Also, it's just a as you as you pointed out pre-commentary. It's a it's a nice change. 
I, yep. I, I would use maybe the Glop gun, or I would blow myself up because I forget pipe bombs. That's an easy thing to forget. Yeah, but the... I don't know, the, the, the Gloop gun is still kind of awful, and that, uh, that the electrical pulse gun still just burns through ammunition way too quickly, so... I don't know. Yep. Machine gun it is. Yeah. I mean, I think we still have one more weapon to get. And, wow. And there's also the secret weapon for Some getting days. all of the nukes Some in hard mode. Time. Is it, is it, uh, Golden Pro Fist? No, it's some kind of electrical it's cannon. Just, shh, it's supposed to be a secret. I don't care, it's an electrical cannon, and it actually has a weird, I don't know if it's a feature or a bug, but if you load into a level while holding down the like the fire button, it just instantly kills everything in the level. <laughs> so I, I, I don't know if that's so you can go through the level without the hindrance of enemies or what, but I, I, I guess it's a bug. Do you but, get all the ego too? Uh, I don't think so. But it's a, it sounds like something you might have for playtesting or something. What what it, what were the things like that in playtesting? Like things to uh, kill yeah. all enemies and shit. Yeah, I mean, oh, that's why like console commands for PC games existed. Like you can oh. press the tilde key and it'll bring up uh, the in-game console, and you can type in something like God mode. Oh. Game. God, Tildy, I how I hate you. Because Why is it? it's a very if you could, no, because uh, I have a European keyboard and a uniquely Icelandic one, so my Tildy is not in the same place as the American one. Where is it? Uh, this is very this is very important to know for the LP. Uh, I had to. I don't know where it was, but I, I had to key find it. It it mine is shift. Uh, the button next to one, but I don't know where the fuck it is in American because I always had to go into system files and well, on the key American bind keyboard. it to something. On the American keyboard, it's right next to the one, like but, to the, the left of the one. But it's just why did it never work in like Half Life and shit? Uh, I don't know. I mean, uh, for later games, in a way, they just disable the console. I don't get that. I mean, it used to be that every game had cheats, but nowadays you never really see them. Because I don't want you to cheat. No, I mean... That's why you have fine modders out there that, you know, open up the game files themselves and manipulate them that way. I don't get it. I mean, what was wrong with cheats? It was just to go shit, having fun and that kind of thing. Uh, I don't really know. I don't know anything, that's why I play Duke Nukem. <laughs> but we are actually almost finished with the level, it's just a short walk of shame here where I kick everything in the face because double damage rules. And with that, we'll be walking inside the uh, the oil rig next time on the next exciting mission of Duke Nukem Manhattan Project. Oh yeah baby, stay tuned for another exciting episode of Duke Nukem Manhattan Project.